What's going on everybody? How's everybody doing out there? Well, today I'm just going to bring you a brief update on my N-Scale layout, the Saigoglin Creek Railroad. So let's take a look at what I've been up to. So I'll continue along this section here. I'm going to try and fill in some of this area here, get this worked out. So the more I can get this back corner done, I can reach from about there out. And this will be a lot easier to work on. And I can probably make a little more progress once this... First, I'm going to solder these two joints together on the bridge transition. This is a piece of flex track. So I'll get that soldered and I'll fill these in and we'll move on from there. I'll just use a few scrap pieces to build up the area and then we'll put a platform there. So I got a nice little roadway going up, little platform, little transition down. I'll fill the rest of this with probably sculpt a mold or plaster cloth. But that looks like it's going to work out pretty good. So while I'm waiting on the glue to dry, I'm going to attempt to make a sandstone retaining barrier. And I'm just going to use one of these little scratchy awl things. I'm not really going to measure. This will probably rip it, so I'm going to go at an angle. And I'm just going to push in some lines here. I'm not, not measuring at all. It's in scale. Yeah, it won't be perfect, but we'll see what it's going to look like. I'll just keep doing that all the way down and I'll come back and stagger some of these lines different sizes make them look like sandstone for my retaining wall and there you go got them all done yeah it looks like a sandstone slash brick it's got a decent pattern to it once it gets painted up we'll see what it looks like get some black washes in there for the joints there's the first coat of paint so you can see it's got some definition now. So I'll go ahead and let that dry. Put the second one on. Get them grout lines pronounced. And I got that dry. Now I need to lay some plaster cloth on there so I can put some ballast down later on. I'll just go ahead and plaster that cloth, the rest of that out over there. And go from there. There we go. I'll let that dry up a little bit. I got a place right back there. I need one more piece. Once that dries up, I get that piece put on. I'll put some paint up there. Put that track back. Got out the sculpt and mold. Did a little forming. Letting it dry. And uh, kind of stair step down. I'll probably sculpt the mold that. But did that little build up there. Trying to bring that out and get that finished off. End up running with plaster cloth. Now, I noticed on plaster cloth that you got certain sharp lines that just lay it, don't touch it. You can smooth off the top. And then just come back in, put one more sheet, and smooth that sheet. That way you don't get all that stair stepping going on. But uh, that's going to wrap it up for this update. We'll continue on later on. Real quick, I almost forgot about the sandstone wall. That's uh, two coats of paint. And the black ink is still bleeding through from the foam. So this piece is still a work in progress. Well, there you go. It's a little bit of progress, but progress is progress. That whole back wall there is hard to get to, reaching over, crushing things. Sometimes i got to get up onto it and work on things. Crawl through my little gopher hole I got made back there. But, yeah, this also comes down to time and money. And speaking of money, I'd love to give a shout-out to D-Rail Daryl and Tammy Ray for Mom and Sons Trains Rail Fan YouTube channels. They both gave me super thanks. Take a look. And also, don't forget, I have Buy Me A Coffee. That helps greatly. It goes a long way. All the money I get goes back into the layout or some form of rail fanning. It all goes back into the channel. And I appreciate it. So, Tammy Ray had also bought me a coffee. Well, as you've seen, it was a few coffees. But, yeah, nonetheless, I thank you very much. Go to both Tammy and Ray's. And Dero Daryl's channels, check them out. They both have great, great channels. Tammy's been really kicking some ass on her layout. I mean, her layout is huge. Ray is happy as a uh, pig and slop and having a great time on his layouts. So go check them out. Links will be in the description. And don't forget, I also have memberships. Stop by, hit the join button, see what you like. You might uh, en enjoy some of the things I'm offering. All right, till next time, like, share, subscribe. Don't cost nothing. Hit that button. Happy out.